So guys, um, we're just in the middle of a, a quick break from uh, filming a tutorial with Babs, um, but I wanted to kind of jump on quickly and um, just tell you about India's birthday that's coming up. So she's uh, got a birthday on the 6th of September and um, I want to make it really special um, this year for my birthday. She arranged a surprise meal, which like I had no idea about. It was totally amazing. It was gorgeous. It actually made my eyes leak when I got there, which was really embarrassing in front of everyone. But but anyway, the point is, she always goes above and beyond um, for me, and I just want to kind of, you know, give something back and make this birthday really special for her. So I'm trying to arrange a, a few surprises and. Um, I've got, yeah, I've got, obviously I've got a few like presents and stuff coming that I've ordered and um, we'll probably go out for a meal and stuff, but I can't just do like a surprise <laughs> birthday meal because that would be obvious that I've just totally stolen what she did for me, which wouldn't be cool, would it? Um, so yeah, I'm thinking um, obviously as well as a few little, like some nice riding clothes and stuff like that, which I know she loves and I know she wants. I'm going to surprise her with a horse, <laughs> which is so cool because I know she's going to love it. So I've got um, the most gorgeous mare by Indian Rock um, crossed with Rousseau and India absolutely loves her. Now she's been off and she's had a foal. I rode her up until the age of six and she kind of, she knew she could do a flying change and she, she knew a bit of PF and Passage kind of work. Um, she was very hot mare and uh, I was short of time, didn't really have enough stables at the time and I knew I really wanted a foal from her anyway so I just thought actually she's, she's really far on for her age, why not just have a, put her in foal and I'll have a foal and then you know maybe bring her back into work or depending on our situation it, you know maybe have another foal or what I hadn't really decided just because um, you know I'm not sure where we were going to be or what we were doing. But anyway. India doesn't know that I'm thinking about bringing her back into work. I think she probably thought I was going to put her back in foal, but I have just haven't really spoken to her about it uh, as such. Um, and she absolutely adores her. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to try and arrange for um, a transporter to pick her up and bring her here on India's birthday and surprise her with her and, um, yeah, give her the ride on her. Hopefully she will love her. I think they'll be a really, really nice fit, actually. Like I say, like, Bonbon bon is a super hot, sensitive mare. Um, and Indy's riding um, two mares at the minute and they're both sensitive in their own way and like she just gets this really nice um, bond with them so anyway oh she's just coming down now on the horse side that go but yeah I'll, ca I'll catch up later with you and I'll fill you in a bit more on on the progress hey guys so um, yeah so <laughs> I, uh, I left you last time because Indy was just coming uh, down with the horse and so obviously I had to stop chatting about what we were doing um, but she's just gone to get her nails done now. So this is kind of like the perfect opportunity for me to try and get some things arranged. I'm just about to give the, the transporter a call now um, to see if we can arrange getting the mare delivered for Indy's birthday, like in the mid morning or something, just so that it's a, like, we'll kind of do, do a bit of the yard and do presents and stuff like that first. And then hopefully Bonbon bon will arrive with a big fat bow on. <laughs> and all Indy's dreams will come true. <laughs> but anyway, I'm just gonna give the, the transporter a call now and uh, yeah, fingers crossed. Probably not. Hello? Hi, hi Anita, it's uh, Henry Boswell. You came to me the other day with a horse. I have got um, a bit of a funny one really. It's, it's India's birthday on the 6th of um, September. Yes. And I want to get my mare delivered back for her on her birthday. And I just wondered if you were free on the Let 6th of... Let me check my diary. Hang on two secs. Yes, I am. Would you be able to bring her like, like mid-morning, like late morning? Maybe. Yeah, that could work. Fantastic. You're a total star. No problem. Okay. Keep All right. Perfect. All righty. Thanks so much. Oh, Cheers, bye bye. Woohoo! So, I mean, that's tick one, isn't it? So, yeah, hopefully, um, Bonbon bon comes back. She looks gorgeous. So, I mean, oh, I'd love her for my birthday. <laughs> um, I mean, it's, uh, it's one of those 
there's a lot of, a lot of work to do with her, so it's not like I'm um, <laughs> passing on a, a horse that's ready to go, but I think like the I just know that the combination will work so well for them. And uh, I know India's like chomping at the bit to do more riding. Obviously she's riding the two mares that she's got at the minute, but um, it's not enough really, you know, for, for how much she wants to do. And obviously I'm riding loads of horses, so it's nice for her to be able to kind of uh, ride another one and one that's really nice quality that we know. Because obviously like every horse that you ride, you know, if you're riding three horses a day, you're improving three times faster. I mean, it's that simple. So yeah, I'm super excited to get her back. Hey guys, um, so it's Indy's birthday tomorrow. I know that I already started this a couple of days ago um, when I was talking to you about what I was arranging. Um, oh, I'm out of breath, I'm a bit hot. <laughs> um, so it's, uh, we live in a tiny, um, like small apartment at the yard. And um, yeah, don't come in. <laughs> I'm literally, I'm hiding in the spare room. <laughs> I'm in the spare room so that I can wrap her presents and get everything ready. Um, but basically just trying to keep her out of the way. Um, I've got loads of presents to wrap. I've literally just um, like baked cake. <laughs> I'm like, you can't go in the kitchen. So I want it to be a surprise. Um, not hanging on that. Anyway, yeah, so this is it. I'm going to get the presents wrapped now and then um, like decorate the well I can't do that tonight but I would like once she's in bed I'll probably get up early tomorrow and like just decorate the lounge with a few um like birthday things and I also got some balloons oh yeah um yeah about to wrap her presents um and yeah I just got her like those like riding bits I mean you know, I'm not going to show you now she'll probably show you um tomorrow when she opens it all but yeah, just like loads of like riding, riding arms and a bit of a matchy set. It's so hard buying presents for Indy because like she's so, she knows exactly what she wants and what she doesn't want. And it's really easy as a boy to just like get that totally wrong. Um, but anyway, yeah, I better get on with it. Ah. That means I have to get the cakes. Ta -da! I have to um, get them out of the tin and um, let them, oh my god, wonky camera, sorry. Um, I don't know how to do this. Amateur vlogger. Oh my god. Uh, anyway, yeah, so I've got to get them out of the tin. And then ice them, but not yet because they're too hot. <laughs> how do you get them out of the tin? <laughs> I've never cooked a cake before. Oh no, the thing's attached to it. Oh, it worked! Oh, that looks so good. Look at these bad boys. Wow, that's so much stuff. Not all of that's from me, by the way. Uh, um, her bro and her dad have like sent their gifts here for me to wrap. <laughs> Thanks guys.
Yesterday, while you was in the shower. Are you wrapping paper? Well, yeah. I w it wasn't really. I was going for like a full wrapping. It just looks like parcel force. <laughs> <laughs> it's so cute. <laughs> wow, that feels like Christmas Day. Yeah. yeah. I think, is it bad to have cake for breakfast? <laughs> oh, it's all so cute. You did well, baby. So um, just so I jump on quick because Indy's gone downstairs, but I have um, texted the horse transport. I'm just waiting to hear back when Bonbon's going to arrive. So everything seems to be going to plan so far. Um, yeah, this morning went really well and uh, having a good day so far. Just need to make sure that we are around when Bonbon arrives so she can see her coming down the drive. I think that would be really cool. So keep fingers crossed that it all goes to plan. Hi. <laughs> so you're saying happy birthday. Yeah. Happy birthday, mommy. Happy birthday. Alright, lads. <laughs> Who are you going to ride first? I'm riding Raisin because we've got um, Addington this weekend. The MCI National. So she's going. Turn around. Oh, you're such a camera hog. <laughs> um, she's going this afternoon. Hey, Babsy. She's like, I want to go. <laughs> you got the nationals next week, baby. Yeah. <laughs> There's a lorry just arrived. <laughs> you better go down. See if it, who it is. Must be a lesson for you. <laughs> My teacher now. Yeah. So I, I arranged someone to come for a lesson for your birthday, so you could earn some money back with them presents. Yeah, I would. Just me off. Go and Go see what it is. Oi! Doggy! Come! Come on! Come on. Have we got any friend on the yard? 
gì vậy không? Bom bom. You should take your horse. <laughs> Does she travel all right? Yeah, fine. Yeah. Oh, thank you so oh, much for God. bringing her over. Oh, she's a hot, sweaty girl. She's still got a bit of her baby weight on. <laughs> hey, Bom Bom. Not, we're not judging. You still look great. Oh, she needs a water bucket. Yeah. Okay. Oh, where are you? She is. <laughs> back to civilization. Yeah, back to the real world. Yeah. She's like, no thanks. Yeah, we'll be back. <laughs> I was quite happy in the middle. Should we get her a water bucket? Yeah. Oh gosh. She looks oh. so good from when we last saw her. I know, she looks amazing, doesn't she? She looks great. <laughs> oh, she looks <laughs> I think they do start to drop off though, don't they, when they know they're not feeding them. Oh, thank you for not doing that. Oh, That's bless her. That's most appreciated. Wow, I think I can stop filming that. Has she been? Yeah, she's probably been in a barn for a few days, um, I think. Do you want to tell them what's just happened? Well, they kind of know because I already told them. Oh, <laughs> but, uh, yeah, okay. so I mean, I just thought that obviously... Do they know who she is? Yeah, I've, I've said a bit about her. Um, but you obviously are itching to do more riding, aren't you? And um, you've got the lovely two mares that you've got. And I just thought she'd be a really good fit for you because she's a, a real sensitive little hottie mare. Yeah, and ever um, since I've met her... You've always loved her, haven't you? I've had my eyes on her, haven't yeah. I? Yeah. <laughs> Secretly. And she's such a talented horse and I think I can just see it. I can see her really blossoming with you, so yeah. I think it'll be a great a great thing girl. to be a part of. You're a girl's girl. Mm -hmm. Kind of wearing the so what, we're going to give her a little makeover maybe today? Yeah, and obviously give her a little bit of a bath because she's all sweaty and dirty. Yeah. She's had a mane cut so she looks like a dressage horse. Mm -hmm. And just make you feel nice. Yeah. Because she's probably had like, you know, she's been a mum. She's probably felt that neglect and not looked after herself. <laughs> you know, when you have a first kid, not that I know. Uh, Oh, make you feel nice. Yeah. She looks so well, though. Yeah. When she we does. last saw her, she had a pot belly. <laughs> um, uh, I think it's um, really nice for her to have a little makeover today, and obviously, she'll have a few chilled weeks now, won't she? Go out in the field a bit, just get really settled here before yeah. we start doing too much with her. Yeah. Yeah, we want to ease her in. Really slowly, yeah. You know, she's in a new surrounding, so you don't want to overbear her, but. Oh, bonbon. Cool. <laughs> Time for the makeover. Shoes on. Oh, Hi, Lex. Oh, she's so beautiful, bonbon. She's tall.
Did that not be recording the whole time or did you stop it? I stopped it and oh, okay. it again because the <laughs> tail was taking too long. Uh -huh. um, doesn't freak out about the shampoo. She must be one of the but only that ones. That was Belinsky. <laughs> drama. drama. How'd you feel, Bob? Like a whole new lady. Oh, my phone fell. Mm -hmm. Don't mess up your hair. You just did that. <laughs> Say hi guys. Hi. Hi guys. A Timio. A Timio. <laughs> no. And then I was all hi Elaine. Hi. Are we ready to go out? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Have you had a good day? The best day. Tell us all about it. Uh, it's been the best day, hasn't it? Cutest. Cutest day. Best birthday ever. We went top. You've been absolutely ruined. Yeah, I have been spoiled. Good birthday, wasn't it? The best. We loved it. It's not over yet. Yeah, and we're, we're going out for dinners. We're going out to a really nice pub for some food. Delaine has joined us. Come here. It's always fun. Come on, guys. Oh, These guys actually gate crashed our first date, so it's really nice that they come to visit us again. Gate crash our birthday parties now. Yes. Yeah. Every year. <laughs> it's a special year. Yeah, we hope you liked the vlog. If you did, give it a thumbs up. If you thought Henry pulled off the best surprise ever, give it a thumbs up. And subscribe to our vloggy vlog vlog. Yeah, and we'll see What's you. It? Like and subscribe to me. Like and subscribe. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm mute. <laughs> I'm Tobin. Nighto. Nighto. Why are you having that? <laughs> oh. We should put Post Malone on. Uh oh. <laughs> Are we having a, a drop of champagne to finish that? Oh, oh. Timothée? Uh, champagne? Do you want champagne? Champagne? Champagne, is it here? You want champagne? I'm done. No. Champagne. You just... Oh, a cup of tea. Cup of tea. Elaine, yeah. what have you got over there? <laughs> wow. Hang on, I need to... Go. go again. Ooh.